what is piperana? Because that's in the book here. I love the piperana. piperana. It's just a, a salad. Yeah. Then we love it. You nice say and fresh. Just, yeah, but you see, what I try and make a salad. It's uh, it's it doesn't taste of anything. Tash makes one. You make one. It's as good as anything I've ever had. What's the secret? The secret is the ingredient. You know. Right. Buy the best and really don't touch mass. You know, but the ingredients you have on, to talk. But what would you put on it though? In a salad? Yeah. Important, I always, I will say, um, good tomato yeah. now in season. Uh-huh. Um, put some very good peppers. Yeah. Just chop it up a little bit. Bit of oil don't, though, some oil. Important thing extra virgin olive oil. Extra virgin olive Bring oil. Bring everything together. And very important as well is you like, ser- is you like vinegar. Yeah. Sherry vinegar. Okay, mixed up or? Mixed, mixed up, well. And some kind of herbs. Okay, would you put any lemon in or anything no, like that? No. The vinegar makes Any rapeseed oil or anything like that? No. No, nothing like Come that? Come on. Spanish extra virgin olive oil. Okay, all right. And obviously it's very important that your tomatoes and your peppers aren't fridge temperature, they're room temperature. That's room important. Temperature. I will say never, ever put a tomato in you the fridge. You can't taste it, can you? Will it kill every single flavour, the smell, you know. When you take a tomato, just put in your nose. Yeah. The aromas coming, yeah, it's just absolutely amazing. Those aromas have to be in the. Tomatoes. How do you stop your tomato salad being too watery? Mine tends to be watery. Is that you put uh, maybe you just uh, put too much salt in the beginning, or you leave maybe, it there? I don't know. The salt always try to take it out. You all think the so? Juices can so be. not so too much. That's too much salt. Too much salt. Or okay. and just dressing just before you are gonna eat it. All right.